Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Beyond Blue. Last time we left off, we did dive to and found out about, as I named that episode, creepy ship noises, because uh, I didn't like that stuff. It didn't sound good to me. I didn't enjoy it. It, it was bad. I did, I did not like it. So let's see if there's anything here at our flight chair, as it were. I can call Ren, apparently? Hey, it's Ren. Leave a message at the beep. Is there actually a beep? Hey, Ren. Why's your phone off? You said this was a good time to call. Ignore that. Someone was messing with my whales today. I was just hoping I could vent to you a little. I hope your test went well. Hey, we had a whale of Palooza today. Anyway, give me a call when you can. The whales say hi back. All right, so that's... Oh, okay, now we can call Andre and Irina. Hey, Mirai. How are you? <sighs> Doing all right. How are you feeling? Any better? A bit. I might finally be getting my sea legs. Next step, diving. <laughs> One step at a time, Mirai. <laughs> okay, but I promise you, it'll change your life. Is Andre with you? No, just me. Andre is analyzing some sound files in the other lab. I think I may have upset him. You upset him? Or that noise upset him? Because it certainly upset me. He was overreacting, and I pointed it out. I was not overreacting. Andre, I didn't realize you were on. What did you find? This is video and audio from your last dive. And this is an analysis of the sound that spooked the family. <laughs> And this sound is from the Canadian Marine Acoustic Scientist. I think the findings are pretty clear. The signatures sound the same to me. He gave me the same test. Andre, who is messing with my whales? Deep sea miners. Here? In the research zone? It's off limits to commercial activity. And when has that ever mattered before? We don't know that they are in the research zone. They may be just outside it. We knew they were doing an impact study nearby. What are they after? That might give us a clue. They're looking for rare minerals to make solar panels. Could the sound cause trauma to the whales? The acoustic specialist said it might push them to quieter hunting grounds, but was unlikely to cause acoustic trauma. So what's the move? We should use our mapping drone to investigate their activity. And this is where our debate turns into an argument. We need that drone to map the deep sea vents before Mirai dives there. The biochemistry of these vents is the perfect cocktail for creating new life forms. If there is illegal activity there, we have to stop it. Otherwise, there will be no life forms. Why spend our short time here policing rather than researching? Let's be scientists. Mirai, your dive, your call. I want to investigate these miners if they're going to be doing something harmful to the ecosystem, I'll personally. I'll dive in the vents without a map. Nobody messes with my whales. Message Rin? Okay, I already did that. So we can redo the call with Rin, we can redo the call with Andre and Irina. Oh wait, no, the new- oh, it's a message from Rin, like a voicemail. Hey Mirai, sorry I missed you. Misplaced my phone. Whale of Palooza? Is that a real thing? Tell whomever annoyed you I'm coming for them. Hey, nobody messes with our whales. Does your submarine have sonar? Maybe you can find the bad guys with that. Maybe that was the answer they were looking for on my test. I was hoping to chat live too. You need to help me figure out a better plan for next semester. Miss you. All right, now I think we are, whoa, she was inside the seat of that chair. I saw that. That was creepy. All right, so down we go. We're going for a deep sea dive. Yay. Day five. Open ocean, east of the atoll. I'm ready to play back a coda sound to Andrea to see her response. I'm definitely worried that the family has gotten smaller. Not sure if they were just spooked by that sound or if something else is going on. Staying hopeful. Ready to dive. All righty, let's go. I'm in and okay. Oh, Jesus. I always feel like I'm swimming Don't in like place it. in the open ocean. I don't like it. I hate it. 
Think the Explorer drones will flag me as biodiverse? You're not what they're looking for. And that's what everyone says. <laughs> wow. Riff. Approaching the buoy. Alright, what do we got? What even is that? I don't even know what that is. It looks like some sort of big fish. I don't I don't think it's a whale though. Hey, a newcomer. That song sounds familiar. All right, but who are these the from Andre's Who are these big boys? Scares them all away. Or are they sunfish? It is. It's a sunfish. Look at them. Look at the big guys. Oh, I like sunfish. Ever since I caught my first one in Animal Crossing. Is it a jellyfish? That is a big jellyfish. And those are hammerhead sharks? Indeed. Yo, hi guys. How we doing? I also got another sunfish over there. I'll be sure to go hit up. Yeah, sunfish looks so weird. Like, I remember seeing one and I'm like, is that a real thing? Like, the first time I saw one? But yes, yes, they, they are a real thing. And they are very cool. And there's a dolphin. Hi, dolphin. You need to come here so I can scan you? There we go. Okay, group survey. New or a repeat? All right, so we got to scan it for abnormalities. Is this a new whale? Whoop. I want I want to examine that thingy. There we go. New whale. We'll designate this one M4 because why mess with a good thing? All right, what song are you playing, buddy? So glad to hear you. Those noisy neighbors silenced enough of your friends. The sounds don't sound like the prior songs. These are more social sounds. Yeah, he just wants some friends. Man, that hammerhead shark, just the silhouette of it in the distance. Creepy. Don't like it. Well, I think that's where we're supposed to go. So I'm going to go over here and hang out with my dolphin buddies first. Yeah, man, just like, and also that's, that's another fear of mine. Just seeing silhouettes in the distance like that, that doesn't, that doesn't do it for me. That spooks me too. It doesn't take much, I guess. What is that? A moon? Oh, that's just another jellyfish. I was not expecting to find orcas here. They don't look like Ooh. killers. Top of the food chain, just like us. Minus the urge to destroy ourselves. Yeah, orcas are pretty insane. And quite evil at times, it looks. Because they're incredibly smart and they'll just do, like, crazy things. I mean, they're just doing it to get food, but seeing a poor seal just chilling on a, um, like, ice floe in the Arctic and then seeing a bunch of orcas get together to just knock them off the ice floe and devour them is, like... It's dark. Alright, so that's... Everything here. Did I scan you, big guy? Yeah, I did. Alright, so let's go now. Over here. I really don't... Just don't look down. Just don't look down. See, the funny thing is, I'm not afraid of heights. But I am afraid of, like, deep ocean... That's the only time looking down actually scares me. And we scanned a lot of jellyfish. Oh, it's a turtle, I think. I didn't get a very good look at it. Let's see. Yep, it's a turtle. Andre, are you seeing this? Is that a leatherback turtle? I didn't think there were any left here. What happened? Egg poaching, and the nesting beaches got too warm. Where's your little spot? There it is. Bio sample acquired. 
Do you think your turtles are making a comeback? Well, I wish I could be optimistic. It's just as likely our turtle is taking the long route home to somewhere else. No. Uh, hammerhead shark, sir, why are you coming towards me? What if I just bump into you a bit? Bump. <laughs> That's funny. I wasn't sure how he was going to react to that, but he didn't really seem to give a shit. He was just like, whatever, man, that's rude, but I'll let it pass this time. He didn't even kind of swim away or anything. He just really wasn't bothered. So what is this? Because I don't remember... I thought I got all the waypoints. Did they add a new one? Oh no, these are just the orchids again. I've already scanned the orchids, though. Yeah, I've already... Oh, there's zoom scan points. Oh... Okay, yeah, that's what I missed. Has okay. anyone been tracking them? I'm still waiting to see if there's a match. Hello to you too. An orca orca sounds always sounds so cute, but then when you realize there's a reason that they're called killer whales. Yeah, it's much more dark, I guess, to me. So, have I finished this? I, th I think there was one other thing they said I had to do here. Or was it just scan both of the points? Yeah, okay. So we're good now. Let us go. Oh. Still, I just can't do it. I keep like, I'm just gonna look down and I'm gonna go until I hit the bottom. One, it probably wouldn't let me, and two... I mean, honestly, in this game I could probably do it. Feels like my birthday, and that buoy is my present. Hope it's better than my last birthday. Dare I ask? My sister got me jeans that were mine for mm, about a week before they wandered off, never to be seen again. A mystery, I tell you. Did you not charge any of these batteries before you put the sensor in? It's not a battery alarm, it's the drone. Okay, so we got three new game, three new things to investigate. I think we're gonna go to this one first, because it's kind of out of the way. Sorry, Mr. Dolphin, just bumped right into you. Really apologize for that. And also, what does the map of this place look like? Interesting. It's another uh, group of hammerheads. Are you guys stuff I've already examined before? Hello. I just met your friends. Oh, you're talking about the orca. Okay, let's scan you. And let's find your weight and record your sound. Are we sure no one's tracking them? Nothing has turned up. Pretty low weight. Arena, do you think this one could be sick? I'm honored you believe I could tell from this distance that my knowledge of disease extends to all species. Fair enough. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, is she like a marine doctor or something? But no. I guess my question got answered for me. Ah. Uh, I gotta say, this feels... more realistic, I guess, than Subnautica. Of course, not to say Subnautica is unrealistic, but Subnautica was so densely packed with things. There weren't very many areas in Subnautica where it was just open ocean like this but to be fair the entire area of Subnautica takes place in a very very specialized crater on a planet that's mostly deep ocean like you're, you're basically in a crater that's elevated so there's an insane amount of biodiversity there because anything outside of that crater on the planet is like Dolphins. small fish always showing off hey Andre can you make your manta drone do synchronized swimming guess we'll see uh, not small fish. I said small fish. That is absolutely wrong. Massive fish. Only Leviathan class fish live outside the crater. And there are some Leviathan classes that live inside the crater. Let's log you in. But yeah, you're basically you find out at some point in Subnautica that it's just like, oh yeah, you're, you're just in like the shallowest ocean on the entire planet. Whale shark. You're right. That is definitely not a dead battery. Unless we're using whale sharks as batteries now. Big boy. There's already a tag on it. Then scan the tag. Sure, like that was obvious. 
I'm leaving another tag. Alright, and what's this tag? Much better than a dead battery. Okay, now what? Oop, we're going back to another buoy. Sunfish always look so weird when they're just coming at you. They're just so oblong. Oop, another jellyfish right there that I haven't scanned. And another one. Here we go. Ooh, and another one. And I think that's the family of hammerhead sharks that I've been scanning, so... I won't bother scanning them anymore. I'm really amazed how well this game runs, because it's doing a lot of stuff with, like, lighting and all of that, but it's just running perfectly. I've had games that look way worse be a bit harder to run and record for me at the same time, but this just runs and records super, super well. It's pretty amazing. Maybe they're doing some very, very clever stuff with uh, obscuring the pop-in by having a fog show up at a distance so you can't really see what's going on, but if so, that's really impressive and it's a good way to do it. You guys just hanging out with your uh, hammerhead shark buddy? That's cool. That's fun. Glad you're enjoying yourselves. There's another one of you. Didn't All you right. pick this dive location because you tracked the baby's pod out here? Uh, I said they were heading in this direction. Uh, hunting activity. Andre, yep. the buoy is glitching. I don't know what range you've set, but I think I'm hearing all the animals in the Pacific. Yeah. Too many sound signals for the software to keep up. I don't know what kind of party I'm crashing, but pretty sure I'm gonna love it. What is happening? It's a bait ball. Humpbacks? Orcas? Very unusual, but everyone's gotta eat. Are you safe down here? I'll try not to be mistaken for a fish. Of course dolphins show up. Never like being left out of the action. Mm, they want leftovers. Good luck to them. They're up against bigger stomachs. That is super crazy. Just the idea that there's a giant ball of like krill and other small fish just hanging out so all kinds of larger fish come here to eat it and whales. Super super cool idea. I never understood the concept of a bait ball but it makes so much sense. Have I got the humpback? Well I haven't gotten this one. Hey there buddy. I've almost gotten enough humpbacks. Hey, big guy. Yeah, I've gotten you. I, geez, I might be mistaken for a fish in a second. I'm like right in the middle of this thing. Also, there's a lot of those on screen. Like if you get in the middle of it and kind of look at it, <laughs> I got a little bit of frame drop then because that's a lot of things being rendered at once. And I'm sure only a certain amount of them are actually, like it's probably just a moving GIF basically and I'm looking at it. Like it's just a moving picture, but once you get inside of it, things start to get a little bit hairier. Okay, so we're done here, it looks like. Yeah, that was neat. Yeah, see, that's what, that's what I kind of like about this game. It's showing a lot of interesting concepts that I would have never understood otherwise. And it's showing them to me... Here they are! You were right, Andre. I guess I didn't just swim across the Pacific for nothing. There's just a lot of concepts that are being shown to me through gameplay in a video game, so it makes it really easy to remember and learn. Yep. So it seems like these this particular pod of whales we can just rescan every time. Like it doesn't mark them as already scanned. Are there fewer than before in this pod? Or am I just getting faster at tagging? No, definitely fewer. But maybe the others are hunting. No, no, don't leave me. Well, the mother stayed with the baby this time. Okay, ready for playback? I've prepared a coda you can activate from your dive watch. Alright, so we gotta go over here. Hello. Okay, first attempt to speak whale. Well. Hopefully I won't offend her. Echo clicks. I could feel it across my body. Just checking me out. 
First contact. She zoom scanned you. You have no idea what that felt like. She was looking right at me. Whew. You have no idea. That must be super, super cool to actually interact with a whale that way. Alright. So I think how I'm going to do this series now that I found out that for sure basically the, all of those songs are copyrighted is when we go back to the submarine I'm just going to walk up to this thing and I'm going to pause it and I'll just edit all of that out and you'll probably just see me hanging out by the music machine when I come back so that is how this is going to go. Is this my little tablet that I can look at my discoveries on? Yeah. Songs of the Sea. Like I said, it is weird to watch these in a game, I feel. Practice collaboration to hunt, learn about... Like, these are basically documentaries, and it would just feel weird for me to watch this in a video. So, we're just going to read these things. That feels more normal <laughs> to me. Want to find anything new about you? Nope. Just how big you are. Scalloped hammerhead shark. Yep, you like the sunlight zone. <laughs> Jeez. That cough came out of nowhere and surprised me. Oh, we did find out some new things about you. Andre will trace the origin of the tag to see what study might be in progress with this whale shark. New Wi-Fi tag to employed acoustic tracking. Okay, so we didn't really get much in the science log this time. Alrighty, but uh, I think we're going to go ahead and end this episode off, because usually I like to do one dive per episode, because there's no telling how long each dive will be. So, I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Beyond Blue. Oh, hey, sunfish. Welcome to my outro. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Beyond Blue, and I will see you next time.